Buzzword is the new online word processor from Adobe, and in this vignette, I'm going to take just three minutes to show you how it, Buzzword goes far beyond current word processors in helping you collaborate with others on your documents. And the way we do that is by sharing documents with others. And we've discovered that uh, some people sometimes miss the share capability. So if you could look down at the lower left-hand corner of your screen, that's where you could take a document and easily get it to others to share. And what you do not do is you do not attach it to an email in any form and then send it off and hope that it's going to come back. Instead, what you do is go down and click the share button, as I'm going to do right now. And after you've clicked on share, you can uh, then just simply type in the email address of a someone that with whom you want to work. In this case, I'm going to choose Walt Whitman. Uh, I'm going to choose what level of access I want him to have, whether it could be a co-author uh, who can change the document in any way he needs, uh, a reviewer who can add comments, or a reader who can just uh, see the document. I'm going to I'll leave this checked so that they will get an email reminder. I'm going to click here and say, here's the document. And then off it goes. With the invitation sent, I'm, I'm back at Buzzword now. And you can see at the bottom part of the screen, the area that we call the collaborator bar, you can see not only am I viewing the document, but also you can see here that Walt Whitman has been added to the collaborator bar. When I hover over his tile, it says he hasn't yet opened the document. So now I'm in the desktop of Walt Whitman himself, and here you can see the email invitation that Buzzword sent out on my behalf. You see here, it's a very simple email. It says, I've shared the, the document Buzzword intro with you. This is the name of the document we were working on. I can actually click on the link. Walt could click here and go right to the document, or if he's a glutton for a little bit more work, uh, could highlight the, uh, the URL down here, the link to the document, and paste that into the browser. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the easy way, click on the link, and I'm going to bring up uh, the document in a browser and I will um, appear here as Walt Whitman and you can see at the bottom of the screen yet again you can see that Walt Whitman uh, is the co-author that's me in this role viewing it and also Tad Staley is also viewing the document so here we can see the collaborator bar beginning to get fleshed out you can add as many collaborators as you want as you need in the document whether they're authors, co-authors, reviewers or readers